people, I am so excited, like always, to be here with you again. We are going to be working with February 8th to 14th, and the 14th being Valentine's Day. And I am one of those people that absolutely adore Valentine's Day. It's hard not to when you work in school, especially elementary schools, because there's card making and baking and crafting and everything turns into pinks and purples and light baby blues. I just, I love it. And I have always been a big fan, regardless if I have had a special person in my life or not. I actually did not start um, dating until I was 17. So there were many years in high school where um, it was just me and my friends and I had a really great time. So anyways, enough with me blabbing on and on and on. Let's go ahead and get started. Like always, I'm going to take my weather icons that I create with my Cricut and I'm just going to line the top of my planner with them. I am using my Pilot Friction Point Pen and it is in the .05. It has a really fine tip and I'm going to go ahead and write the highs and lows of each day. Today I'm going to be using Nicole Alexa Designs and this is her Heather kit. I'm going to go ahead and take the checklists and alternate them at the top. I'm going to take the matching to-do headers and place them right above my heart check boxes. Perfect! They look so pretty. I definitely love the quality of the sticker paper. It is a mat, but it is so easy to reposition. It is just very nice to work with. I'm going to go ahead and place the today headers down next. I'm going to use the six half boxes that she has in her kit and I am going to place them underneath the today headers. On Saturday, I will probably just use one of the smaller boxes that she has. I did order a few more kits from her, so I'm really excited and I think I might have to buy more. Anyways, <laughs> enough with my sticker addiction. <laughs> I'm going to go in and use these full boxes as well as these boxes over here. Okay, so I absolutely love this whole entire kit. I I just do. I love everything about it. Um, I have used up all of my um, half boxes and all of my full boxes. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to place her weekend banner over here. It kind of blends in quite a bit. I wish I had do 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 something to make it pop a little bit more. You know what? I'm going to actually take this off. I'm going to I'm going to put this washi strip right above here. I'm going to take the Erin Condren ruler, place it by the side or on the side and pull up. And I'll place the weekend banner right underneath it. 
so it pops out just a little bit more. I think I'm going to leave this section for now. I'm going to take her washi strips and very carefully I'm going to try to place them just um, right over top of these two black lines, these writing lines. Okay, perfect. One there. There we be. There we be. I'm going to focus now on my sidebar. I'm going to take one of these cute washi strips. I'm going to place it over here at the very bottom to cover up this little piece of red. Using these little check boxes, I'm going to stack them up on my side and use these little headers over here to write some extra things in. So we've got this portion of the sidebar done. I think what I'm going to do now is I am going to place my quote for the week over there. I'm going to be using these washi strips to fill in the background of my thankful thought and hopefully I'll get them as straight as possible. You never know though. <laughs> okay, so I've covered that all up and now I'm going to place this one right here. And I am going to take some of this washi strip that I used for underneath my weekend banner and I'm just going to place it over top. Now that my sidebar is done, I am going to go back in here and start filling out my information. The first thing I'm going to place down are my YouTube task icons and I just made these with my Cricut and if you'd like a DIY for them, I do have a video. Just go to the info button and it will link you to the video for this. Before I place this down, I'm going to fill in the rest of this with some of the washi strips. So on Sunday morning, I always try to have my video uploaded and ready for viewing. On Friday, I need to make sure that I film it and edit. Wednesday, I'm going to actually have another video upload and play for you guys at around 2 p.m. It sounded like a um, a good idea for a video to be uploaded? I don't know, you guys have to let me know if 2 p.m. on a Wednesday would work for you guys. I also would like to know if you guys would prefer um, watching videos on Thursdays. I, I can only ever definitely do one video per week, but I'm gonna try to throw in one other day here and there just to um, get caught up in some of the things that I wanna share with you guys. This is going to be jumping back and forth. I'm so sorry. <laughs> On Sunday as well, I want to go grocery shopping and for Friday is I'm actually going to take one of these art boxes. I'm going to place a Facebook over here. And I've got my Instagram. And then I'm going to place my little things right over on the top. Here we go. On Thursday is a huge, huge event at our school. It is the kindergarten open house. I'm going to put this strip down here. It's really hard to see, but it has tiny little hearts, which is super cute. And then I am going to place this down here. And I will take another one of these and place it down here. And then I am going to put a little things. Important, very important. On Wednesday, I am going to go ahead and do the same thing that I did on this day. So I am going to take another heart strip and place it right over top of my upload button. And then I am going to place another washi strip right here. And then I'm going to place the Facebook again right over top of the heart. And then the Instagram right beside it. There we go. And then I'm going to put another little things over top of it. And this one is in the pale pink. On Tuesday, Mark has to proctor an exam at the school, I believe. So I am going to use that time to be in my classroom and just 
do another deep clean, I am going to use another one of those ombre top three boxes. And oops, I am going to use um, some more washi strips. I'm going to place that at the bottom, this at the top, and then I'm going to place this. Perfect. And I am going to place a matching little things header. I just absolutely love this kit. It is so well thought of and it's so complete and you have absolutely everything you would ever need. And I'm going to put a little don't forget over here as well. I think Monday I am going to go ahead and I am going to relax a little bit. I think it's probably the only day in the entire week that I will get to relax. Maybe I will check the mail. So I will go ahead and put this as well. I could do my banking. I'm just like looking at this sheet and saying, hmm, what else could I do? I could get these things done. Actually, that's true. I do need to get my tax information finished up and sent off. I'll place this right here. And then I will place my correlating little things. And I think I might put this lazy day. And a little exclamation mark. And one more exclamation mark for good measure. I'm going to place this box over here and then place a little cross on top of it to mark my Sabbath. I'm going to put one of Ellie Beth Designs UK stickers right over here. I am going to put a little flag over here. I'm going to put a Lily Henry coffee cup and also a lunch bag as well because I will have to pack a sack lunch. On Sunday, I usually do my grocery shopping, so I will put that there as well. And again, this is from Lily Henry. Monday, I hopefully have some mail coming, so I'll place that down as well. So it completely got cloudy on me, but I will probably have to go back in and um, put some decorations in and add a few more things. Of course, I didn't put anything up Valentine's Day-ish for Sunday, but Mark and I will be going out and um, having some dinner together. This kit has been very amazing to work with. If you liked this video, give it a thumbs up. If you have any comments or questions or concerns, leave them down below. I always love reading them and I love your input as well. Have a very wonderful week. Bye for now.